think John is now finished pulling up. So what we have to do now is push this down and shove it all the way over. So I slammed the lever across. Now I've been told all I need to do is press start. Now that's all opened up all the valves, I think. Oh, I just need to wait for John to get out of the way. And then we can turn on the hydrant over here. Sorting out the swivel. So he's just trying to line the beams up. Like beams like this, beds like that. So I think he's just twisting it to fit the bed. I think he's unhooked and done now. He's alright. I'm now just waiting for John to get here because I'm going to need a spanner. That's too tight for that to uh, crack off with that. So we'll just crack it off just a little bit. Hopefully it won't crack it off too far to like spit out at us. Just enough so that we can then turn it safely with the hydrant on. But uh, she's ready to go. And that'll just feed our aster plants. Which uh, in this dry weather they're still struggling that little bit. Too good. But uh, you look down that end of the field, it's got a good crop of green, lovely green. So hopefully, in a couple of weeks' time, we've got a good crop. And then they're all planted in stages. So then we have week one picking, week two, week three, week four, and so on. You get the idea. Well, we're loaded up and ready to go. As soon as Mark gets out of the way. I think they're dropping there, actually.
that's fallen off the cradle. just like that. I had to take the topper tyre back to the yard because the inner tube had gotten the puncture. I think I may have done this from uh, going into the road mode. I think I let the wheel down a little bit too hard. Never mind. Just parked outside the workshop. Like a glove. Well, Saturday, here we are, and I'm now about to clock off. So that's been a bit more of an in-depth uh, what I do in a week. Uh, didn't capture everything, got most things though. So uh, this time of year it's just sort of busy, running the road, keeping the uh, tube lifting happening, basically. So uh, thank you very much for watching. Um, Make sure you like and subscribe, leave comments if you've got any questions on what we do here. You know, tulips aren't exactly the normal thing that you see in the UK, so feel free to ask a question, we're happy to answer. So, yeah, I've been Lewis Eves, I hope you enjoyed my week. See you in the next time.